So, um, I just wanted to make a video of, um, uh, as you can tell, uh, I sound a little snuffy. Um, I'm getting over a cold. Not COVID, a cold. Took my COVID test. It's all negative. Um, but yeah, I just want to make a video um, talking about the classic firearm competition contest. And um, I, I don't know if it's just me, but it just seems rigged. Does anybody else feel like that? Like classic firearms is just doing it to get the promo, but yet still, you know what I mean? There's nobody ever coming out and say, oh, I just won this competition. Like they've been doing it for almost maybe what a year or two. And that's like a gun every week. So that they might have after given given out like a hundred guns already. Some of these guns are worth up to six grand. The current competition the gun is worth over $6,000. I think it's a Steyr 308 bolt action. And it never seems like anybody from anywhere wins. Like anybody from anywhere, anybody knows wins. It just seems like it's a bunch of people from some no-name place that actually wins this competition. And I've been entering this competition for as long as they've started it. I, I was buying stuff from Classic Firearms before they were classic firearms. Um, I think I bought my Polish Tonto from them. Uh, I might have bought a few other things, I just don't remember. I bought uh, crates of 54R ammo. So I've been supporting them for a while. Um, you know, but for me, I really don't, um, I, I try to buy from a lot of online stores because I want to give people the business, you know? But with classic firearms, the shipping is for me, what, what prevents me from buying a lot of stuff from them, the shipping is a little expensive. Thirty dollars to ship this, when I nah, I, 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 it's 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 a little expensive, you know. But um, I still support them. If I see something that I really want, I'm gonna buy it, regardless of the price. Anyways, you know, even because I love classic firearms, I, I've 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 been a fan of them for years. But at the same time, let's get back to the the, the point at hand. Uh, we're talking about the competition. Do you guys think that anybody actually wins this? Because if you've noticed, if you watch a lot of a lot uh, the previous. Um, competition when Clint um, when when they announce that somebody wins and they say for instance two weeks later they have a couple competition going on you look in the background and the same previous guns that have been won they're still on the, the backdrop so I'm like how did how is it that 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 somebody won this gun and it's still back on the same on the wall like what they just they just make multiple of the guns and give away one and then stick one on the wall i mean i'm pretty sure that they could do that they're classic firearm they have a whole warehouse but it doesn't seem to me that anybody has won anything i've i've and you, you guys can challenge me i've gone on google and i've searched winners of the classic firearm competition nothing nothing comes up nothing comes up i've gone on youtube i've searched winners of the classic firearm competition nobody made any video and let me tell you this and if you're watching at classic firearms if if, if I win a, 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 a like a Python and a SIG MPX if I will a Fulton Armory M4 um, if I win a, a scar 17 or a scar or a scar 20 let me tell you something man I'm telling everybody I am telling everybody that I won. There is no way on the planet that I'm going to get a free gun. Listen, if somebody puts me in a competition and they give me, a, um, and, and, and I win, uh, what's that cheap gun call? Uh, crap. The, um, the cheap gun that, you know, everybody calls a brick. You know, if I win that gun or if I win uh, any kind of gun, if I win a knife, I'm telling the old world about it i'm making a video about it man i win a scar or scar 17 or a scar 20 oh man you you can't shut me up you cannot shut me up i will make a video every week video shooting it video cleaning it video sleeping with it video video washing it down video talking to it video feeding it man you can't get me to shut up about that thing bro so i just don't understand how they're giving out these firearms some of these firearms just just the um just the optic alone on that thing 
is worth more than I can afford. You know what I mean? So if I win a gun that has an optic that's worth 300 bucks, the gun is worth another 1500, the grips are, you know, this and that and that, and adds up to three, four thousand dollars, which I don't have. You best believe I'm telling I'm, I'm bragging on you, you bastards. You know what I mean? I will be bragging. That's bragging rights. And you never see anybody come on YouTube. You never hear anybody come out and say, hey, I just won the classic firearm competition. I just won the SCAR 20, the SCAR 17, uh, the SIG MPX, uh, the Cold Python. Like nobody ever says that. And why is that? It seems to me that it's rigged. I don't know what classic firearm, I mean, I can't say I don't know. They can sell your information every time you 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 subscribe to whatever. Now it's more people now that they can just text out their all their information to and, and send out their, their mass text to tell you when they have ammo to sell out their the shipment. So yes, they do get something out of it. And if it's a scam, classic firearm, listen, man, it will be shame on you. And I think one time they I, I made a comment in one of the comments and Clint never responds to me because I guess he doesn't want to get that kind of, you know, conversation started. And I said, yo, why is there nobody ever, you know, coming forward? Why, why is there the pictures of the people that win? They never have any picture, you know, to show their faces. Why can't I look up that person and say, yo, who is this person that just won this competition? You know what I mean? So for me, I'm just like, you know, what the hell? Is, is, are people really winning, winning this competition? You know what I mean? Is it just to put their name out there? And yes, I, I, and I know people are gonna say, you know, you know, it's easy for them to put this put this comp uh, competition together because they can afford it. Yes, they can. You know, they're they're a big dealership. You know what I mean? They can afford to sell guns cheaper, and they can afford to do competition like that. It's a write off. You know what I mean? What they pay for the gun is not what we pay for the gun. You buy, you know, uh, fifty, you know, Steyr Aug fucking sniper rifle and guess what you're getting them at a drastically discount price as opposed to just you know me and you just buying one but what do you guys think do you guys think i'm reaching do you th think i'm just i'm just bullying like what do you guys think about this competition because again if you guys find a winner on the internet that said he won a classic firearm competition and he can prove that he can show us like you know his entry and whatever he used to win then hey i want to see it I want to see it. You know what I mean? I want to see this. You know what I mean? Because I really think it's it's rigged. Listen, I've been entering this competition since the first one. And I don't think I've ever missed a competition. And I've done everything. Every night I get up, every morning my ritual oh, is do my prayers, classic firearm, do give my subscriptions, and then boom. And I can't win. And I'm just one guy. I know I have friends that religiously do that. None of them win. So say for instance, it's the odds. Because Clint always come on and say, oh, it's just one, it's just one entry. Okay. I have at least five or six friends, right? That enter a competition just like me. Because they have some guns up there. You like, I got to have that. Because I can never afford that. Not in this lifetime. Not with Corona and my bills and all that stuff. And and listen. They're they're applying they're applying to the competition. I'm applying. So say for instance, I get like for one competition, I put in say three thousand uh, um, uh, uh, points that put me into the drawing, right? And the other five of my friends, they're doing the same three thousand. So say we're collectively one person, right? And we enter that competition. We've been doing it as long as he started the competition. And we can't win. And yes, I know there's hundreds of thousands of people entering the competition. I get that. But say we're moving as a collective one. And we can't win? What chances of one guy just, you know, just mowing along, mowing along has? You know what I mean? So for me... If Clint and Classic Firearm are doing this just to get our information so they can sell it or just to advertise so they can, you know what I mean, you know, uh, get their, their their brand out there, then you know what? Hey, more power to them. But don't mislead the people, man. And if people are winning, what like, 
why, why don't you I think somebody did a competition before I can't quite remember if anybody in the comments remember let me know somebody did a competition and they flew them in and um, they flew them in and and shot with them I think it was Iraqi veteran 888 they were giving away something and the guy who won I think they've done it uh, one or two times before they, the guy who guy that won they brought him in they flew him into their um, to their farm or their their range he shot with them they hung out with him and then he showed that he actually won you guys are classic firearms man you guys make thousands of dollars what's a, a, a ticket and a motel for your winners you, you should do something where every time somebody win you fly them out for maybe a day or two you know what I mean come out shoot the weapon with you guys talk about it and then send them back home what a ticket from wherever anybody lives to classic firearms is what maybe 300 bucks to put them up for a night is another 25 dollars a night for a motel you know what i mean because you only like me if you put me up in your living room i'm okay as long as i get to go out there and shoot some nice guns and you give me a six thousand dollar gun man i'll sleep on your floor you know what i mean but there's no videos out there check if you don't believe me guys check youtube check youtube Look if there's anybody out there in YouTube land that said, I just won the $6,000 classic firearm competition gun and I'm so excited. There's none out there. Cause I've, I've, I've Googled it already, you know? And if you can, and if this is Clint from classic firearm, hey, feel free to, to send me some information, show me all the winners. Cause I can't win. None of my friends can win. Nobody I know anywhere can't win. Other people that I've sent the, 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 the competition, because there's people who say, yo, what is this? I share it with them, and then they try it. They're like, yo, this is bullshit. You know what I mean? I've been entering this for six, seven months. I'm done. You know? And that's kind of where I'm at. I'm like, yo, why waste any amount of my time entering a competition that I know I can't win? You know what I mean? Like, what you guys should do is do the, 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 the raffling or however you guys choose the winner. Do it live. Do it like a like do it like a like 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 a like like the lottery. If 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 it's a if it's a generated system that you guys are using, I've seen YouTubers do that, where they've done the the the, the generation because they don't want people to feel like they're rigging it, and and pick a winner. Do that. Don't just I don't we don't know what you're doing in the background, and I'm not saying you guys are cheating, but I'm saying you guys might be cheating. You know what I mean? Like do it to where people can see it. You you do a raffle, show us how the generator generates stuff, and do it live. If if if, if you're only gonna show the computer and you know what I mean and what the computer is doing, do it, do it, because it don't seem like you guys are giving away any guns. And I'm being honest, like I'm not trying to be facetious or a uh, 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 be antagonistic or I'm not trying to be you know giving you guys a bad name. I've bought stuff from Classic Car Farm before. You know what I mean? I love Classic Firearm. I love what I've watched almost every video Clint put out. My favorite video of Clint is is the one where he did the Call of Duty one. You know, AC-130 above. That was like my like favorite video he does. I have nothing against you, but I have something against a company that seems to be doing something shady. And don't think that any company is beyond doing shady shit. You know what I mean? Like, you know, I don't put anything past anybody. Family, friends, loved ones, trust me. You know, if they're humans, they'll do some shady shit. You know, pardon my French. But um uh if anybody in the comments, man, um, you know, you know, believe what I'm what I'm saying, give me a thumbs up, like the video, possibly subscribe if you like what I'm saying. I got a lot to say about a lot of stuff on 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 in the gun community, man. Um, but like uh classic firearms. If you're if, if that's what your guys are doing, cease and desist and do it correctly. And like I said, if you're doing a competition, you know, make sure you're doing it. Do it live where where everybody can see. Do do the drawing. Like once you guys do you decide to um, pick a winner, pick it live. You make a video. You 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 you, you shoot tens of rounds to, to to make the video and all that stuff. Okay, what's you know what's five five minutes of, of 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 video time to show the winner it's not going to cost you guys nothing you know what i mean so you know please um show us show us how you guys pick the winner and put our mind disease because in the comments 
where you guys never really comment. People say it a lot. People say it a lot more than you think. They hint at it. And I see all you guys, the commenters out there, trying to hint to him. Oh, I really want this. Stop it, man. It's pathetic. Oh, I really wish I win this one. My girlfriend say, you know, she's never had a gun for birth. She would be great for her first gun. Stop it, man. It's pathetic. I see those comments, man. Those are pathetic, man. Stop doing that. You know, don't 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 beg, man. You know what I mean? If you win, you win. But you know what I mean? If it's a legit com legitimate competition, you win, you win. But I hate those commenters that are constantly there, like, oh yo, I wish I could get it for my first gun. Stop it, man. You want to get it for your first gun, save and buy. You know what I mean? Um if I see a gun on Crossing Firearm that I want, I, I just save and buy that. I don't have to win any competition. But I'm saying, you know, it seems riggish. You know what I mean? It could just be me, but it seems riggish. Hey, comment, like, subscribe, start some dialogue. Let's see if we can change some stuff with Classic Firearm, man, because I don't think that competition is real. I really don't think so. I don't think so.